This playlist is about E, T, L, extract, transform, and load. So uh, what we're doing is extracting from a Excel table, right? So one of the very important things when you're um, inserting into a database is you got to have a unique identifier. And I did some Googling and I, I saw, you know, stuff on Stack Overflow that looks like this to create a, to a great ID. And this is kind of difficult to use and I tried it and it doesn't work. So I was thinking my, maybe I can write my own quote unquote unique identifier, right? So I was thinking if we're going to do this like, you know, once an hour, we can use the time to create a unique identifier, right? So um, there's a you know nice function in Excel that equals now to give us right now, and then then we have you know Dave and Bob, and this can be auto numbered. You know this little trick: you right click and you scroll down, see how it goes 15, fill series. So if you have like 10,000, you can just fill that in there, right? So I can copy this, put this in here, and now, so our grid ID, okay? We want this to be uniquely identified so we can use it as a primary key, foreign key to join multiple tables together. So this is how I wrote it. First of all, I took a you know part of this value day, and and it's gonna give me 17 seven for the month the year and then hour and minute so this gets pretty uh, unique right here right and then we concatenate in the so just fyi f2 was going to show you the, what is uh being part of your uh, formula here so then we concatenate this value so now we have one two three and four so you copy this paste so now we have a pseudo grid ID here we can use for inserting to a database so this is going to be a whole series on ETL and uh, we'll further dive into this thanks